trying to get this skin glowing, okay? And this hair growing. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jess Environment Peace. And today in this video, I'm just gonna be doing like a talk through video. Um, oh, is it a talk through? No, but it's not called a talk through. It is called a story time. Basically a story time video, just um, touching base on a few topics. Um, so it's about, where, where my phone? Let me see, what time is it? It's 7.20 a.m. As you guys could see, hopefully, whatever. So it's 7:20 a.m. and um, oh, it's the top of the morning. I was gonna do this last night, but I'm like, it's gonna be really hard for you guys to see. And right now, even the sun doesn't even look that good. Um, I do have this thing here behind me because I don't want to give away my location just for safety purposes and my privacy or whatever. But um, yeah, we here today. Uh, I'm gonna be doing a face mask and first i gotta clean my face off or whatever yeah so i've never done this before so i want to be in here acting like oh my god i do this all the time in my car nah boo it's the first time okay all right so i don't even got all my stuff together like is my is all my stuff together it's not it's really not all right so i'm gonna go through i'm gonna have to cleanse my face really quick first um, I went in this morning to QT and I went ahead and brushed my teeth. Now this is a simple tip. I don't know if p people know this um, and I don't know where QT is located at in all states or whatever. But here we have like this gas station. It's called QT and um, it's a very popular gas station. And I normally go there sometimes in the morning. Something if I if it's like I need to use the restroom or something, I go there nine times out of ten. Basically, it's my favorite gas station. I ain't even gonna lie, it's my favorite gas station. Um, they never steer me wrong. But yeah, so I went to QT this morning. Now, uh, when you go inside of QT in the mornings, a lot of people don't know this, but there's not many people in the bathroom. Like when you go to QT, yes, it like first thing in the morning, it's gonna be a lot of people there, but not a lot of people in the restroom. Like they're not in the restroom. They're in there grabbing their coffee or paying for their gas and they out like, like a light, okay? They're not in the bathroom, so I be in that bathroom in the morning taking my time. One morning I was in there for a long time. I'm like, damn, ain't nobody gonna come here? Ain't nobody coming in? Like, it's just what it is, you know? So I don't want this video to be too long, so I'm just gonna go ahead and jump straight into it. So, um, yeah. All right. Hopefully, let me see if I can angle my camera because it's starting to get real dark. I might have to pull it a little bit closer to me. Yeah. Hey, let me see. Let me see something. What are we doing here? Okay. All right. Hey, y'all. Okay. Um. But so what I got today is it's this face mask. I had got it from Ross a while back. Um. It's a detoxing face mask. Um. Pierre's, and this is what it looks like here. Um. Basically, come on now, focus. Yeah. This is what it's looking like here. And it's a mud mask. And then I'm gonna. Well, first I'm gonna cleanse my face with some Cetaphil. This is what I use on my face. Again, y'all, I don't got the perfect skin. Don't be trying to use this video as, oh my God, we're gonna find out how to get perfect skin. Uh, no, you're not. You're, you're, I'm sorry, you're not, because I'm still trying to learn myself, okay? All right. All right, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do this really quick. Where is the spray? In my spray bottle, okay? I have a towel here as well, too, just so that like the water doesn't go everywhere. Like, everywhere. Let me see. I don't think I like the way my camera is. It's like, I ain't back up a bit. I'm gonna have to move my pillows over a bit. Okay. Now we talking. Hey, y'all, we talking, y'all. I said we talking, y'all. Okay. All right, so, yeah. I'm gonna go through and wet my face first. Let me get my, um, my spin brush, y'all. I be using my spin brush. All the time. Who? Boo, all the time. I'm gonna also leave the link again at the bottom of this video so that way you guys can check it out. But, um, really quick, I'm about to go ahead and do this. I can actually do it in the camera instead of in my mirror because I have to be turned backwards. So, if you guys see me looking over here, it's because I'm looking in my screen. And I ain't gonna be able to look too much because, boo boo. Your girl can't see that good with any of these glasses. 
So let me zoom on in. Hey, hey, hi. Okay. So yeah, <clears throat> gonna go through first. Like I said, with my face. Boo. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um. Maybe I should turn it on. There we go. We're gonna wet my face again. This is my first time. It's not my first time washing my face in my car. I have videos of me washing my face in my car, but as far as doing like a mask in my car, this is my first time. So, just get my face as wet as possible. Last night I didn't cleanse my face because I wanted to do everything and show you guys like the truth. Ooh, yeah, or whatever. So um, I'm doing it here now on this video, but normally I would cleanse my face at night. And um. <sighs> Yeah, I have a lot of dark spots, like a lot, a lot of dark spots in my skin. Like, what do y'all use for dark spots? If anybody has like hyperpigmentation, hyper, 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 hyperpigmentation. Comment below. Let me know what y'all use. Um, y'all know I lost my job or whatever. I lost my little job. Um, so I have to use my insurance by the end of the month. And uh, I got about, about a week or so left, so I need to go ahead and um, see if I could. I know to get an appointment with the dermatologist, it sometimes there you, you gotta book your appointments like months out in advance or whatever. And boo, I ain't got months to wait, like, I ain't got months. Shoot, I only got a couple weeks, if that. So, um, uh oh, so yeah, I want to, I'm gonna spray a little bit of water on this. Um, on my spin brush just a tad bit too just to get it a little wet okay but yeah so i'm i'm gonna go see this dermatologist they actually say because i have an hsa account a health savings account and i know those don't expire um but i'm gonna go see go to this um dermatologist in charlotte north carolina it's called urban skin i think that's it i think that's it i'm not sure don't don't let me lie to y'all but it's called urban skin i believe and i want to go there to see if i can get some product um i saw really nice reviews online about it also my best friend she went there y'all know i can't see that good so hopefully my camera is focused if not i apologize in advance but um yeah my best friend she went there and she got some stuff for her skin it saw great results so you know i'm trying to get up in there okay i was low-key thinking about getting a chemical pill too um they also have that option there to get it at that location a chemical pill they have an at-home chemical pill and they have one where they do um at the facility but i would probably do the one that's at the facility because i ain't trying to mess up nothing and i ain't got no at home to be at home doing no you know what i'm saying i just don't but i know there's um certain things that you would have to do like because i saw some youtubers do it like a skincare let me y'all y'all know i can't see but I, had, I saw some YouTubers do the um, chemical peel, and um, their face was peeling. I know they were like they were out of work for a week or so, but y'all know I ain't got no job. <laughs> so boo, it's time to get this skin glowing, okay, and this hair growing. So um, I think that's what I'll do, and I'll probably like go because my parents don't live in the same state I'm staying in currently. So I probably would see if I can stay with my parents or my sister or somebody during the time frame that my face is peeling because i don't think you can be on like any direct sun or something like that i know it probably wouldn't be the healthiest thing to do while living in the car so yeah i'll probably just kind of um crash at one of their houses and you know go from there i just feel like i have so much more time to do things that i wanted to do um now that i don't have a job and i feel like i can dedicate more time doing things that i wanted to do so we're gonna look at the positive of this of course as always we're gonna try to keep that peace but um yeah y'all this feels so good i mean am i the only one that be too excited to wake up just to wash her face y'all i be so excited be like oh my god i'm so excited to wash my dog on face it's just the only thing is I know most of this because um, my cycle was on last week. So I know most of this probably came, my acne is coming from hormonal. 
or whatever, but boo, you gotta go. Like you doing a lot. Come out here doing all this for. You feel me? Do you feel me? Okay. Ooh, y'all. I ain't even gonna show y'all how dirty my Okay. Ooh, what was that? That's a lot. Like, boo, what what you was doing in here? Why is this so dirty? I don't know. But now nah, it's probably too because like I probably didn't get all the makeup off of my um off of my skin because I use I use makeup wipe removers but child that they do not be getting all the makeup off I be going back scrubbing they still be makeup on I be like but where you come from okay how'd you get there I washed you last night why are you here on my face so yeah I um I'm pretty sure that's where that where that's coming from just gonna wet it a little bit. When I go into the gym, I'm gonna clean my brushes off because I normally take this in the shower with me. Um, so I'll clean my brushes off once I go to the gym. Y'all, if y'all did not see my my story, my my story about me getting well being hostage in Planet Fitness, bruh, y'all better check it out. That shit was so crazy, and it was more to it was more to it like. She was saying other stuff, but I was just like, I'm not even going to say that on my channel because it was just so, it was just so, oh God, oh God, it, it was a lot, a lot. And I'm like, oh, sus. Like, you really feel that way? That makes me think like, dang, like, girl, what's going on? You need some? That bad? I mean, I guess. Shoot. I guess. Okay, this will work here. Y'all, this mirror, my ex bought me this mirror for, I think, my birthday. Yeah, it was for my birthday. And, um, it's very convenient, actually, in my life right now. Thank you. So, this way, washing my face. All right. Woo! Y'all, if y'all not follow me on my Instagram page, make sure you guys are following me. I upload a lot of pictures on there. Um, I love to dress up and I love fashion. And I feel like, you know, now that I have so much time, I'm able to, like, post more of my, like, fashion photos and actually dress up and, like, post photos and stuff. So if you guys aren't following me on my Instagram, make sure you do so. And again, um, I'm sure I stated this before in the video, but I like to, um... What is all of this? All this. Oh, it's coming from my towel. But I like to post on my, my IG story. I really do. So I post every single day on my IG story. So if you guys want to see more of me versus just on YouTube, because I post, what, maybe like three, four times a week on YouTube. But if you want to see me like all the time and see things outside of my videos, um, Make sure you guys follow me on my Instagram. It's findingjazz26. And I also have another Instagram. It's vibrant underscore peace. Um, and I hope I'm saying it right. I hope it's not no numbers in there. Hold on. If, I'm going to put it down here so y'all, y'all, you feel me? I'm going to just put it right here so y'all can see it. Okay? But yeah, so let's go ahead in and um, start the face mask. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. Okay, okay. All right, so I can't. Okay, apply face. Uh oh. For best use, apply to face and nets, avoiding the eyes. Leave on for 7 to 10 minutes. Rinse off with warm water. My water ain't warm, but we're going to do what we going to do, okay? Okay. So this is what the, like I said, I used this before, but I have never done a face mask in my car since I've been staying in my car. Um, I haven't done it actually inside of my car. I've done it at like hotels and stuff. So yeah. Um, okay. Work with me. Yeah, so yeah, this is... I'm going to go ahead and put this on. Like, this is necessary, y'all. I haven't done a face mask, oh God, in probably over a month. Probably longer than a month. Probably been about two months. I ain't going to even lie. And it glides on so... Oop. Child. It glides on so smooth. Mm -hmm. 
but yeah um some other quick updates with me guys um i seen a lot of people comment about vibrant peace merch so i think i'm gonna put that into words i'm gonna go you know reach out to some people see what i could do as far as i'm um, getting some vibrant peace look how crazy as hell i look y'all um but i'm gonna reach out to some people to see um what i could do as far as or what i should do as far as getting some merch out for you guys but i'm excited because i always like promote other people's stuff because i love like supporting other businesses so i love to like support other people's stuff and what they have going on as far as their you know business or whatever even if it's not clothes like it could be anything whatever like i love to support people and um i feel like when you give things out you give it back so me giving out my support for other people i know eventually in return good things will come back to me it's all good karma um but you know I, it's not that i'm looking for a return because i'm doing something i just know how the universe works okay all right you put out bad you're gonna get bad okay you may not get it the same day the next day or the next month but it eventually will come back to you so yeah good karma so the vibrant peas what kind what do you guys want to do i don't want to just do like regular t-shirts you know how like some people just do like oh i'm just gonna do a t-shirt like with my name on i want to do something more to that like more to that what colors do you guys see when you think of vibrant peas like give me some ideas you know um i really want to take it a step further i just don't want it to be just like t-shirts plain t-shirts um, black and white t-shirts. I want to do something a little bit different. Something that's going to actually stand out. Something that's going to be in your drawer. And you, you're you going to look at it. And it's going to be folded. But because of the color, you're going to be like, oh, that's that vibrant t-shirt. Let me pull that out. You feel me? You feel me. Okay. Yeah. So I don't want it to, my shirt to get like lost in the sauce. Or my products to get lost in the sauce. So, um, yeah. Comment below what you guys thinking. I think this is enough. That's what I think. All right, so <clears throat> what time is it? Party time, not really. Let me look and see. It's been 18 minutes, god damn. 